Meantime, tonight a community is honoring the life of a fallen Marine as his body is back home tonight in Naples. Lance Corporal Ivan Garcia died last month near Camp Lejeune from carbon monoxide poisoning. The Night Beats Michelle Alvarez joins us now live at Naples Funeral Home. Michelle, how was the turnout today? There were Patriot Guard writers, members of Rolling Thunder Chapter 5, and local Gold Star families that came together today to pay their respects to Lance Corporal Ivan Garcia. Honoring a fallen hero, 23-year-old Lance Corporal Ivan Garcia was honored with the motorcade procession Monday, led by the Collier County Sheriff's Office. Bruce Page is ride captain with the Patriot Guard Riders. And we're here to escort uh, Lieutenant Garcia to his final resting place. Garcia was from Naples and was found dead last month in a car with two other Marines in North Carolina. All three died from carbon monoxide poisoning. He was just a kid, you know, just starting out, you know, he had a whole life ahead of him. Um, but, you know, God called him. And when God calls, we have to go. So unfortunately, he was a young man, had a lot to offer, but hopefully that he uh, he left some great memories behind for people to remember him by. The motorcade left RSW Monday evening and rode from Lee County to the Naples Funeral Home on Davis Boulevard. It also included escort vehicles from Naples Police Department, Cape Coral Police Department, Florida Highway Patrol, and Lee County Sheriff's Office. Talk to me about why you're here today. Respect. You know, it's unfortunate this happened. A lot of answers. I feel for the family. You know, we're praying for them. Uh, when something like this happens, it's just devastating. So you, whatever you have in your life is not that important when you see that someone lost their life. So you, out of respect, you're going to get here and you're going to ride and you're going to show the respect for this veteran. Tomorrow morning is the funeral for Lance Corporal Ivan Garcia, and police will be guarding the funeral home overnight. I'm live in East Naples, Michelle Alvarez, Wink News. Michelle, thanks.